Let's get to the station and close this case. You know the way. You can drive. So where do you want to go? I don't know who'd be... I have two suspects. Phelps, you got nothing. Biggs, Ryan's waiting for you in interview one. Barley's in two. Hey, Hopkins, you practicing your asshole routine again? Come on, Phelps. Save yourself some time and get this thing off your chest. <laughs> if that's your opening gambit, you better try again. So you want to change the world, Ryan? Yes, I do. So does every reasonable person. And you're doing your part? Yes, I am. Does that include sabotaging water heaters to destroy a company? I have no idea what you're talking about. This is industrial sabotage, Ryan. It's all part of your campaign. You're delusional, detective. What campaign? Your locker is full of pamphlets. Clemens told us how you were always foisting them on people. Sure. I spread the pamphlets. A guy has to do something. Insta-heat heaters break down every day. They're still peddling the same lousy design that they lifted from Hephaestos. Insta-heat bought out Hephaestos? Them, Vulcan, Pyro, and a bunch of other companies. And you still work for them? A guy has to work. And the directors of the company, how do you feel about them these days? You work it out. You know how to reverse a diaphragm in the regulator valve of a Model 70 heater? No, I don't. If you know enough to do your job, you know enough to do that repair. You're lying, Ryan. And how do you think you can prove that? Your boss at Instaheat said that you've all been trained to do it. It's a common repair. Are you calling him a liar? Okay. So I know how it's done. But what would be the point? You'd just end up with a gas leak and then a small fire when you turn the pilot back on. And if you didn't reset the pilot and the gas spread, what was the cause of the fire in your own home, Ryan? I won't tell you. What can you tell me about the Suburban Redevelopment Fund? Nothing. I think Suburban is a front for your anarchist buddies. They're arranging for people to be out of town while you burn their houses down. Suburban? What's that got to do with me? That's Farley's bilk. He's the one with the cozy agreement with those fascists. You have a history of violence. I have no such thing. You're lying, Ryan. And how exactly are you going to prove that? You were charged with attempted murder, Ryan. It was a court case. No criminal liability was the verdict. They said that they couldn't have known that the faulty heater installation would cause a fire. All I know is I lost my whole family. And the company that was responsible got away with it. What would you do? Which company? As Fastos Water Heater Company. That's it for the moment, Ryan. So I can go? Sure. 
As soon as your red friends storm the building and carry you out, you'll keep your seat until we decide how long to lock you up for, knucklehead. You think those vice boys get any on the side? I think Ryan is our man. But procedure says we eliminate all of the suspects. Let's speak to Varley. How bad is it? Come on, you can tell me. We have Matthew Ryan in custody, Varley. I think all we need to do is ask him about this, and he'll write you out. Fuck Ryan, that pinko bastard. Have you ever worked on a place on Rosewood Avenue? Family by the name of Sawyer? Maybe. I, I'm from out of town. I go where they send me. I, I, I don't do a lot of repairs, though. I'm flat out on new installations. Why are you lying to me, Varley? If Suburban wants their new installations completed, why are you bothering with Rex like the Sawyer house? So I'm lying just because I can't remember if I was there or not? <laughs> How can you prove that I was? Your name is on the inside door of their water heater. Okay. You got me there. Suburban, yeah, they wanted that guy out. Sawyer kept complaining about not being able to get his heater service, so they threw in a free service as a sweetener. I think you played him, though. Because he still wouldn't sell. Word is, you're in the pocket of some property developer? <laughs> Never. I got principles. How did Suburban put the squeeze on you? Did they find out about your record? There's no way you can link me to Suburban. You're wasting your time. Ryan says you offered to cut him in on the kickbacks they were offering. He'll testify in court. Suburban, they got real time pressure in getting some of the big developments finished. There's some big date that they can't afford to miss. So yeah, I took the money, but so did a lot of guys, all right? Carpenters, electricians, plumbers. It's no big conspiracy. What would reversing the diaphragm of an Instaheat Model 70 do? Yeah, I made that mistake before. You get a big bang when you turn the pilot back on. So you didn't deliberately sabotage the water heater at the Sawyer house? No, I did not. You out of your mind? I don't believe you, Varley. I think Suburban wants homeowners who don't want to sell out of the way. I think you're out of your mind. Where is the evidence that I have done anything to contribute to this fire? Huh? Arsonists use cigarettes and mosquito coils as time delay fuses. We found an open box of mosquito coils in your locker. Well, hang on. <laughs> Those things... They belong to Ryan, all right? He asked me to hold them because his locker was full of stupid pamphlets. I thought he used them for camping. We're done for now. So what happens? You're either going back to Detroit to face a murder rap, or you're staying here to answer for these arsons. You think the Vice Boys get any on the side? Guy gave his wife a tap. I'd say all's fair in love and war. I didn't come to California to be a secretary. Matthew Ryan, I'm charging you with committing a series of arsons and for the murders of Hank Sawyer, Edwina Sawyer, Henry Sawyer, and Jessica Sawyer. You're putting an innocent man away here. You hear me? I didn't set any fires. I didn't kill that family. Phelps, what you did to your wife and kids was un-American. My wife threw me out. Did I ask for your opinion? You're here to listen to mine. What I was going to say, before I was interrupted, was you did a good job on the Stefan Sawyer case. We don't often get results in arson, so well done. What about me? Do I get a little stamp by my hand or a lollipop or something? What you get is another case. A 
bad one, unfortunately. You're two blocks behind first and second. We have more buildings to clear. You know our orders, There's Sergeant. There's barely a building left standing or not on fire in your zone, Cole. Is your sector full of Japs? Questioning my command. The captain doesn't want anyone falling behind. Tell the captain we will join him when the job is done. Just give us the word, Sarge. We'll take care of him. It should be sectioned. That Jap lover's a fucking liability. We're here to kill Japs, not our own people. Starcross, son of a bitch. No one wants to serve under him. He's bad fucking luck. Can it? We have a job to do here. If I can live with it, you can too. House fire. Bad one. At least four Vicks. Get out there and find out what you can. The address is 650 North Hobart. <laughs> 